In this study, we're investigating how implicit personality relates to leadership effectiveness. And so we measured the implicit personalities of U.S. Army Rangers and then looked at their performance in a leadership development course, the U.S. Army Ranger School. People who have a strong power motive are more effective leaders than people who are submissive. Uh, people who have a strong achievement motive, motive are more effective leaders than people who are dominated by an unconscious fear of failure. And aggression was the most interesting construct we measured. We found that military leaders who were conflict avoidant were worse leaders than those who were highly aggressive. But the best leaders were those that were in the middle. So um, if aggressive people, if you describe them as people who are constantly looking for a fight, then you might say that the best leaders aren't people who are looking for a fight, but they wouldn't run either. Once you measured the personalities of these leaders, and we gained, we gained an understanding of each leader's personality on these three constructs, then we compared a, a large number of criteria. Um, we looked at quitting rates, we looked at injury rates, we looked at uh, leadership, leadership grades, we looked at whether people uh, graduated or not, people who uh, with the same sort of injuries, uh, people with certain personalities are willing to endure that pain and drive through it, where other people see themselves as not being able to go on or use it as a rationalization to leave the course. The takeaway from, from our research project, I think, is that uh, people's personality matters to their leadership effectiveness. Uh, not everybody has what it takes to be a great leader. Uh, there are people who have personalities such that they're submissive or dominated by fear of failure. They're not able to make difficult decisions that uh, are necessary in leadership roles. Um, and then there are other people. They're driven by power and achievement, and uh, they tend to succeed where, where other people with less advantageous personalities would fail.